Alright, this is Von Lagaya, and welcome to Let's Play Croc, Legend of the Gobos. In this episode, we're going to explore the special stage, the first one of World 1, the Curvy Caverns. So let's go about that right now. Hello again, Croc. Walking across the screen like that. Alright, so here we are. We're in the Curvy Caverns. I love the music in this stage. <laughs> it has such like a nice beat to it. It sounds really good. Anyway, we're going to uh, hop on this little platform here and go across. These fireballs can be a pain sometimes, but uh, they're pretty easy to avoid. And here we got 11 gems. 12. <laughs> the gems seem to be sort of spread out in this stage. All right, so we're heading through this door into the next section of the Curvy Caverns. This place, uh, these don't look like caverns at all. All right, um, I'm not sure if we can make it across this gap. There's probably a button we have to push. Yes, there is. We need the key, so we're going to, uh... We're going to go through this door up ahead and see if we can't locate the key there. This is actually the first time I've played through this stage before. So I don't know where the stuff is either. What the? Thing looks like Cubert. Oh, it shot me. Damn. Stupid Cubert thing. All right. I'm gonna go across these. Uh, there's another Cubert up here. Uh, take that Cubert. And we got the key. We're gonna break these boxes just because. Croc loves gems, and he likes to collect all the gems, so we like to help him collect all the gems. The Cuberts don't seem to be respawning. Never mind, it just did. Yeah, take that, Cubert. We don't like Cubert here, so I've never played Cubert. I know that doesn't look exactly like Cubert, but it is fairly similar, so I'm going to call them Cuberts. And as you, yeah, as you can see, the enemies respawn when you kill them. Uh, it takes a little bit, but they do come back. It's a pain sometimes, but that's how the game is. So, I'm not going to complain overly much. Here we go. Push the switch, which should give us a platform across that lava pit over there to get us to that box. Which I'm assuming is going to have a gobo inside. If they put, if they put gobos in the special stages. I don't know. Oh, no, they don't, I don't think. Free life instead. Whatever, it's nice to get everything anyway. And free lives are never... Never a bad thing. Huh. Get out of my way, Cubert. Croc does not like Cubert. So we are going to destroy you, Cubert. Up here we got gems and another one of those pipes with a worm guy in it. Of course who likes to bite us because he doesn't want us to have gems. He wants them all to himself. So we're going to go through the door and get away from that greedy worm. Ah! Oh. Wow! That wasn't nice. I wanted to turn here and go this way, and then we got decimated. I don't know what... Th oh, there's a puzzle piece up here. See, I'm not sure what these puzzle pieces are for. I haven't done the special... the special stages. Oh, what? They end the level. There's still more to... <sighs> Alright, so, well, that was that stage, but I'm actually going to, uh... Go back and check out the rest in the next episode, actually. Or wait, I'm going to continue it, because I think we still have time. So I'm going to go back in here and check the rest of the stuff out. I'm going to rush sort rush through, sort of, because there was stuff we missed. And I don't need to re-get all the uh, free life things or anything like that. So yeah, we're going to go check out the rest of the stage. We 
don't want to miss anything. And I want you guys to see it as much as I want to see what's there. Because we saw there was a locked door up there, right? So we need to find that key, too, and uh, check out the rest of this place. Hopefully I don't have to stop my recording or redo this stage. I would hate to have to do that. Because then that would mean I've already I've seen the stage. All right, here comes the Q-Bird again. Get out of my way. We don't have time to be messing with you guys, q -Bert. In we go. Through this little door thing. Some more gems. Okay, instead of going that way, we're going to go across here. Ow! Ah, <sighs> that was dangerous. Oh, well. So it seems this place was a lot bigger than uh, I thought it was going to be. I did not know the puzzle pieces end the episode like that. Or the level, I mean. So now we're going to try and get the key. I'm not going to get this box because it's just going to have regular gems in and I don't really need it and it's going to waste my time. We got the gold key here. Whoa, careful. And over here, we're going to head over. Still worried about going over the time limit, but um... Oh, not again. Yeesh. That part is brutal. You go on the lava and it hurts you, and then you bounce up into the thing that's and it holds you in there. That is... Like I said, that's brutal. You get destroyed. Alright, so... I go through this little locked door and see what's behind it. That's the whole reason I came back in here. What? There's like little p symbols on there. Not sure what that's about. Uh, anyway, we're going to climb. Since it looks like that's what we have to do. So, I'm worried about going over the time limit here. I really am. Especially with these stupid things. They're never in a good spot for me to jump again and get it. Oh! Crap. Okay, I suck at this. I really do. You know what? I'm going to cut the episode off here, and we're going to continue this stage and the next one in the next episode. So uh, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.